Hello everyone. So today I want to show you a little bit about this camera tripod that I got by D Giant. It has worked out really great for me so far. So it comes in this water resistant carry bag, which is really nice to store it in so it stays safe. So here's the tripod. So at its smallest height, it is 15 inches or 1.25 feet tall. You can open it up down here on the legs. They have these clips that you open up and it extends the leg all the way out. And then you push it back down to clip it in place. And you do that with all three of the legs. It's really quick and easy to set up. And then up here, this pole comes out as well. There's a screw right here that you turn, and this is how everything is adjusted on here. So you loosen it, and then to keep it in place, you'll tighten this screw back up, and it keeps it very secure there. You can have it halfway, and it won't move at all. You can have it almost there, or all the way down. At its tallest height, it is 50 inches, or 4.17 feet tall so it's about this tall and it does work very well for when you're standing up and videoing with it you can also partially extend the legs if you would like so this is very customizable you can make it any height you might need and the legs are individually adjustable if you need to have one shorter than the other for any reason so that's really nice that you can adjust it anywhere in between the full length each leg has a rubber foot on the bottom to help keep it stable this tripod is very lightweight so it's easy to take around with you in its little bag that it comes with so the the tripod comes with two different options for holding your camera. It has the cell phone mount that comes with it, which is really nice because I've seen a lot of them don't come with one. It has a little screw here on the bottom. Here on the top is a quarter inch universal screw. That is the industry standard. It's on almost every camera, video camera, DSLR camera. You can turn from the bottom here with another turn screw here. This piece is also adjustable with a screw here. You can screw it down for smaller phones or up higher for larger phones. So it's this piece right here moves up and down is spring loaded so you can basically fit any size phone in here. So the phone I have here, it has a six inch screen. goes in just like that. Okay, so just to give you another idea of what goes on here. So on the bottom of your camera is the we'll use universal quarter inch screw type hole. And that is what goes into this. So you can actually screw it from underneath with another screw turn and it will hold the camera. It's very sturdy. It's not coming off. It's very secure on there. This tripod will also hold a GoPro. You just need to put your screw here down to the lowest setting so it fits right in just like that. Perfect. Everything on this tripod is easily adjusted. So this screw here, you can tighten or loosen for moving the, it this way and this way. You can fully tighten it so it won't move back and forth at all. Or you can tighten it just a little bit for smooth panning in your videos. So to move it up and down, you turn the handle here and you can make it as loose or as tight as you need it. So while you're filming, you can move and it will look very smooth. So the next one is right here on this side. You turn this and you can move it all the way sideways or you can move it partially and basically put it any way you want. You can go anywhere in between with any of these settings which is really nice. So it's totally customizable to exactly the way you need to video. So it can record straight at the ground all the way up or anywhere in between and you tighten it to lock it in the place that you want. The tripod also has a level here to help you get an even shot. So you'll put the bubble in the middle and that will ensure that your shot is level. So this tripod is perfect for recording YouTube videos or doing family pictures outside or inside. I've been using it for about a month now and I don't know what I would do without it. I'm having a hard time recording this video without having the tripod to set the camera on. So it's been very helpful and I think it will be 
helpful to anyone looking for this type of thing.